Okay, here's a smaller cave. And what we're gonna do is run a ray up on top and demonstrate the easy res, how it behaves on something smaller like this one. I'm gonna back this up. Okay, I'm above the cave where I was just a little while ago. So that cave's right, kind of right down there where my shadow is. And we're gonna set up our array here. We'll run one probe that way, one probe that way. Okay, so what we're gonna do is set up our array up here. We're gonna do a two probe array. <clears throat> Which means we have to use these little jumpers. And uh, basically you just, they're, they're color coded so you can't mess it up. You just put the red to the red, yellow to yellow, black to black green to green and what this is called is a pole to pole race it's just two uh, two probes one in each direction all right once took the green wire look at this one yellow wire over here <clears throat> okay so we need to come on here you can come over here we need to make sure that we set our probe spacing so our probes are two meters apart so we need to set it to two meters. That way it calculates our ohms meters. Ninety-five point eight seven. So I usually write these down. That's at two meters. Okay, now we're going to move the probes out to uh, four meters. Uh, the ray spacing, so it'll give us two meters of depth. Okay, so we've got the array set up at four meters now, which will give us two meters of depth. Which should be right into that cave now. Okay, what we're looking for is an increase in the ohms. And it should be right in there. Okay, 418 kilo ohms from 95. So we're gonna at four meters, we're gonna write that down 418.1. Okay, so that's showing, I mean that's that's jumped up uh, four times, which is showing that it's uh, that current's having a lot more resistance. So now we can drag it out a little bit farther and see if we can get under the cave. Okay, so we've got the uh, ray set at 8 meters now, which will give us 4 meters of depth. So what we're looking for, if we're under the cave, our numbers should start going back down. So we've got to reset 8, 8. Okay, so we're at 469, so we're still... We're still in it a little, and we're still in it, so we're going to go try to go out a little bit deeper. I'm going to write this down. Okay, so what I've done is I've just, we're still at 8 meters. We just moved the array up, trying to get it away from that cave. So, still have this set at 8 meters. Now we should start getting a drop if we're getting out of the cave. Okay, so see 263, so that went down from 469. Uh, that's almost half. So we've moved the whole array up about a meter. So we should be seeing some more numbers drops. So, yeah. Still at eight meters. 
Okay, start. Okay, 172, so we're getting even farther out of it. Okay, so we're still at 8 meters, and I've got these probes just moved back farther so we can get away from the mouth here. All right, so we should see another, even more of a drop. All right, 160.8, so it's, it's consistently going down, so... Uh, there you have it. That's the Easy Res Pro, and that's how you find a cave. And one more thing we're going to do, I'm going to take you a really good ways away from the cave, and we'll do these same distances so that you can see that those numbers will stay consistent without a, an anomaly involved. So we'll see you up top here in a minute. So we've moved up uh, a couple hundred yards from where we were before in uh, a nice little flat place. Uh, this is going to be a little bit different kind of dirt here, so our numbers should be considerably lower. Um, but uh, so I've got it set up two meters like we started at before, so one meter depth. So let's take a look here. Okay, we're gonna go back and set it on two meters. Okay, hit start. Okay, 11.3 kilo ohms. So, you know, you got a lot denser soil up here, so versus 95 where we started before. But what I'm going to show you is that we're not going to get a huge jump uh, like we did with that, that cave. So I'm going to move it out to 4 meters now. Okay, now we're set at 4 meters. Make sure we set our distance to four meters. And yeah, hit start. Okay, 26.08. Okay, so it's just gone up just a little bit, but it's gonna do that a little bit with distance. Zero eight. Okay, now we've got it stretched out to eight meters which is where we were hitting the cave down there. Uh, if you remember, it was 469 uh, kilo ohms down there. So we're gonna set this at eight. And that number should go up some, but it's not gonna go up a lot. Okay, so 58.7 versus 469. Okay, and what I'll show you, we'll go out just a little bit farther too, and I'll show you that it just it's it, it's not just a function of depth that makes it go up really high. Okay, got this set at 20 meters now, so that we can show that it's it's uh, just not a effect of a distance that makes something go up really high. <clears throat> so don't forget, we got to set it to 20. Okay, now we hit start. Okay, so right now it's showing over the limit. Uh, that's a good little lesson here because that can mean two things. Something's not plugged in right, or the ground is getting too dry. Uh, and if it's too dry, what we have to do is pour water on the probes. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go check our connections and uh, be right back. Okay, so all everything was connected fine, so that means that the soil is pretty dry, so what we can do is wet around the probes and it gives it a better connection. So just a little, you know, water bottle full of water around your probe will just give it that much better connection. And if you really need extra, you can pour salt water on there. Okay, we're still set at 20. Okay, so we're at 177, which is still well below that uh, 469 that we saw in that cave, but we're at 20 meters. 
um, and that number will kind of consistently go up as you go but what you're looking for is big changes like we saw down in that cave so there you have it that's pretty good demonstration on how to find a cave I'm Robert with Terra Exploration Group this is the Easy Res Pro one of our tough series detectors uh, it works works well and works as advertised Robert out